Okay, since this video I have a rabbit like enclosure tour, so here's just they shed them overnight and this is fun. It's eight o'clock now so they go in but normally normally eight o'clock we lock them in but it's really really it's nice. It's just a little bit breezy. So we haven't locked them in yet. So yeah, this is the I can't remember which I got this from Pets at Home ten years ago. But yeah, this is really, really old, so I don't know. But yeah, it's six foot by four foot. This is one pet so much made nice watches. And yeah, so they live in here. And so yeah, they used to live in that big shed over there. And then Dottie started getting cage aggressive, where she'd kind of bully... <laughs> trying that. Where she used to bully Mr. Bun whenever he'd go in there, hear stuff, so we had to kind of like be an out all better. And then... I'm hung on my phone so now it's all out of focus. So yeah, this is the shed. So I just thought, I'd, this is the hutch, sorry. And over here they have this pink litter tray, which they are litter trays and it. It has Whoopi's cat litter in and here's another corner one. And then they just squabble, so that's why they have two. And here they have a big, this used to be a old fair plus cage when we used to keep rabbits in this years and years and years and years ago, back like when I was younger. I remember our first rabbit was living in this and that was over 15 years ago. So, yeah, and then we got this hutch 10 years ago. And this used to house Dot. So, we, what we used to do is because we had our trio in the shed and our pair in here, and we just swept them around the garden. And when we got just the trio, we had them just, it's confusing. So, yeah, here's this, this old, and it's just filled with um sh straw and hay. And yeah, they love it. And then this is all we have on this level. And they also have a treat bowl that just has some forage in. So we're kind of changing up the rabbit's diet a little bit and the guinea pigs where they have forage as their last or third meal. And then just here they have their large classic deluxe bottle and hanging up they have a little hay rack and this daisy chain garland, I think it's the daisy chain garland. And then up here they have this big hay rack from Powerland. I'm going to wear the guinea pigs one because I like it. And then the door. Yeah, they've destroyed this bed. And up here they have their bed, and the substrate in this bit is wood shavings and not wood shavings. It's hemp and cat litter, not cat litter, straw. And in here they have a tube that just has a load of forage in. So they have grass, dandelion, sticky weed, and the actual flowers of the dandelions. And I need to top the straw a bit up. So ooh, up here they have the bunny bottle, and this is a little bit smaller than that one. This, that one is a 600 litre. Yeah, and this one's a 320. And here's this bed they've had for years. We're going to buy them a new one next week. But yeah, I love, Roger loves that. And then they just have some fleecy, fleecy items on top. Here they just have their veg bowls because I need. Because I fed them this afternoon. The veg. And they're just having forage tonight for the tea. And yeah. And then that one's Dottie. She is seven. That Roger, he's about six. Well, estimately. That's their pellet bowl, so they are still for pellets. We're going to wean them off pellets, but you know. And then, yeah, this, they all blocked off because this was all like a thingy area, like for like different plants and stuff, and then we had to get rid of it all. We're going to start replanting soon. And under here is the bunny's favourite area. It's just like a little bench. And then here is a tree. I can't remember who, I, I don't know what it is, but it is safe. They have at it. The vet, the vet seen it safe. And then here's the old shed, so there's a little bit of a story behind the shed. So yeah, there you go. And then here inside the shed, we, the only thing, they used to live in the shed when we had Dottie, Boo and Roger living together. And then Boo died when she was 15, so she was an older rabbit, she was older than these two. And she was in charge of the trio and then Dottie and Roger lived in here as a pair and then we kind of went, when Toby died, we moved, we tried to pull Daisy with them and that just didn't work. So then we swapped the girls around, but then what we decided to do is, because because Dottie, she was cage, she's always, she still is cage aggressive, she calmed down a lot now, like, but what she used to do is, when we used to come in here, she'd attack Roger, which, after, that was this one after Boo died, so we had to, like, kind of, like, stop that, so we put them in the hutch, and then we moved Daisy in here, so then we just alternated the girls with Roger, and that worked, for, and that worked till Daisy died, so now they just have this bit, so they are sometimes loud in here, not often, and here they just have their bag of straw from the bale that have somewhere else and some litter trays if this camera focused. And then just in that they have, they do actually have tunnels digged in that, you can't really tell. So here they just have this digging area and this is my favourite thing in the world. So we got this, oh god knows how long ago. 
and basically we used to have these sort of things here and then we dug it down it's like 10 foot don't even that now it's about 10 foot i don't it's not it's five foot deep and then then we have mesh underneath so here we just have a bendy bridge and then the digging area and then here I don't know if you guys saw the table in the shed. These used to be kind of like across it, so we had like a little platform. They, they're too old now to use that, they don't use it. So here they have a bin bag full of hay, two bin bags, mega door, the cat litter, some other things. So yeah, some people ask why don't we have toys, like proper full on toys for the bunnies, because they don't play with them. They stopped. A few months ago, we always changed the toys, but we took them in around an hour ago. Because we are going to lock them in the minute. Even though they have the cat box. Because Dotty loves it. So yeah. Here is their enclosure. And um, I don't know whether. I forgot to tell you this. My bunnies are runners. They don't. Dotty gets annoyed with them. And they argue over them. So they don't, they don't play with them. They just argue over them. So the bunnies are runners. So they just run and do binkies and all that all day. And then we do put tunnels out in the morning. In the afternoon. The night. We take them in about eight. It's about half eight now. So we took them about half an hour ago and then we just let them run around. So yeah, so here's the bunny enclosure tour. So I'll do another one with it, with the toys in. It's just, we always leave this out, but yeah. So thank you guys for watching. Please comment and subscribe and send me links to your bunny enclosure cage tour. So yeah, they have a bit of sticky weed there. So yeah, bye guys.